Every year since 1997, except one, Idaho Fish and Game have given anglers here in the Treasure Valley an early Christmas present. I'm outdoor reporter Steve Dent, and I'm here at the Americana Bridge, where Idaho Fish and Game will stock the Boise River with steelhead. Anglers got here early and waited several hours for a chance to land this gigantic trout. That includes Kirk Smith. And I don't get to say this often, he came from Riggins to Boise to fish. When you catch one and uh, you know you've got one, you know, it's not like anything you've ever experienced. It's just, you know, you've got a big fish on and it's just that fight, that adrenaline. It's just, it's, it's amazing. Idaho Fish and Game takes steelhead trapped by dams on the Snake River and breeds them at the Oxbow Fish Hatchery. Yeah! But the fish not needed for broodstock Woo! get released into sport fisheries for the enjoyment of anglers. I've been fishing since I was five, and I think for me, just there's so many things to think about while you're fishing. The last thing you're thinking about is the problems and, you know, the things going on in your life, you know? So it's just, it's an escape. You know, you don't go to find yourself, you go to lose yourself. But it also creates a different kind of fishing. We call it combat fishing, where anglers need to work together with so many lines in the water at the same time. Sometimes this gets a bad rap from people, but if you come out here and you realize like how nice all these people are, and yeah, you're real close to other people. Oh my gosh, that's a lot of weight. But I mean, one guy bought me hot chocolates this morning. The other guy gave me some lures. Like, I don't know any of these people. You know, so it's really cool just to, to meet new people and it's just, I think it's just a great experience. It's part of Idaho Power Company's Salmon and Steelhead Mitigation Program on the Snake River that helps steelhead make their journey to the ocean and back in conjunction with Idaho Fish and Game as they trucked 125 steelhead to five different locations on the Boise River. I gotta say thank you. Thank you to Idaho Fish and Game. You know, you guys are you guys are the true heroes, you know, because the guys that don't get the opportunity to go up to Riggins or, you know, Washington, you know, the guys that aren't able to do that, you know, to bring it here locally, uh, you know, it's just incredible feat, you know. Thank you for thank you to Idaho Fish and Game. Nice fish. Wild. If you want to come out and fish for steelhead, you will need an Idaho fishing license and you'll also need a steelhead tag. Steve Dent, Fox 9 Now.